We're at Magic Kingdom. It's my first time ever vlogging in Magic Kingdom. How does it feel? Uh, it feels... I mean, I like being in Magic Kingdom. So. <laughs> uh, yeah, we've never eaten at Crystal Palace before. Yeah. Who will be here, though? Yes, we've always kind of wanted to eat here. Uh, Sam's a big Winnie the Pooh fan. She actually has her Pooh Bear shirt on. So we're going to go inside and let you know what, you think, what we think of the food. This is one of the, uh, it used to be a buffet, but I believe now it's family style. Which I like better. Yeah. Uh, the menu looks great, so I can't wait to go inside and try some of the food. If you enjoyed the content, please like and subscribe. And yeah, join us for our time here at Crystal Palace. Right as you uh, walk in, it says, welcome to our friendship celebration. So nice. As you walk in, there, have these awesome areas of Winnie the Pooh and Eeyore. Yeah, and on the other side of the movie, I have Tigger. I'll show you. Here, here's Tigger and Tigger. We have a QR code which Sam is using right now. We also do have some alcohol, which is pretty early in the day. We're not going to be drinking just yet. But yeah, look at the uh, decor, and they sat us right near this uh, very scenic area. Hi, Sam. Hi, I feel like you're very close to my face. Yeah, no, they, we can't sit across from each other. I wonder if I could just pull a chair up. We actually had our table moved because I felt like we were very close. We were. Yeah, so. I think like, we were like against that wall. Yeah, no. So I, I like that we could sit across from each other. The decor in here is very nice. We have kind of, yeah, view, beautiful view of uh, Magic Kingdom, Main Street, USA. Chairs, it's like good, sturdy decor. Uh, Sam got the prime rib, and I got the uh, fried chicken. So I'm excited to try both these things. And the uh, salad comes out first. It's all you care to eat. You also got biscuits. Yes. Home style buttermilk and cheddar bacon biscuits. And then we have a array of desserts that come out at the end. And it's thirty nine dollars per gold. I mean, it, there's, and there's no a, character. And there's a pass holder discount. Oh, there's a pass holder discount. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's good. That's good. Yeah, and it's, it's just a very beautiful restaurant. Yeah, no, it's, it's one of the restaurants that when we first came to Magic Kingdom, I looked at and I went, wow, that I want to eat at that place. Um, yes, yeah, so now we're eating here. Although no characters right now. So what should we think of the food? So they brought out our salad to start. So um, marinated watermelon, watermelon, which I've never had before. Candied walnuts. Gorgonzola. Blue cheese. And some kind of, was it vine ripened tomatoes? I don't think there's tomatoes. I no, there are tomatoes. Oh, okay. There are a certain kind. I don't see tomatoes. Oh, there they are. There they are. You were right. As usual. And then, uh, what are these? These are the plain biscuits, and then there's uh, cheddar and bacon. Cheddar and bacon biscuits. Like. And they have these little... Uh, there's a jam. There's a honey butter. Honey like, butter. This is honey butter. That's a very pooish, right? <laughs> yeah, he loves honey. And then this is just a normal whipped butter, this I think, too. looks good. Yeah, everything looks really good. Ah. All right, let's uh, give you this out. I'm not a big sweets in my salad type of guy, but uh, not until you try it. Yeah, you're saying it's really good, right? I've never had anything like it before. I think it's really good. All right, I'll have to cut mine up and try it out. All right, so I'm gonna try to get a little bit of everything on here. That's a tomato with the uh, oh, arugula. I would never like order this mm. if I saw it on a menu, but I think it's good. It's really good. Not the candied walnuts too. You try the watermelon? Mm-hmm. I think it's a solid eight of a salad, right? Yeah. One of them. It's really good. The biscuits are like hot. I think this is, is this just a normal biscuit? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to try this with the honey butter. You know, who's honey butter on there? Mm. Mmm. That's really good. Wow. Mm. This is 
the normal butter. This is the cheddar bacon biscuit that comes with it. Mm. I'm gonna give the biscuits an eight too. They're warm, taste fresh. Sam had just filled the salad. It's so good. It's so good, yeah. It's very fresh. The butters have been really good. She hasn't tried the biscuits I've yet. I've been eating the salad the whole time, you've been eating the <laughs> But the biscuits, everything has been delicious so far. Definitely, I would say everything is solid eight, right Sam? Wow, look at that. Fried chicken, collard greens. Looks like they have some bacon in there. They have some dipping sauce. Or it's a, uh, I think it's like some uh, maple syrup for the chicken. And then this mm. mac and cheese. And Sam, Sam's looks amazing. That prime rib, right? Yes. What is this, cream spinach? It's cream of spinach. It looks like they gave you a little biscuit over here. Or a biscuit over there. <laughs> I don't even know. I think that's some gravy for your biscuits. I don't biscuits. even know. We should probably. Yeah. I guess we should eat and find out. So that's actually a horseradish sauce and an aju. Spinach and then Asiago potatoes or gratin. That looks great. Yeah, I thought it was just a biscuit when I first saw it. This looks like like a high end, you know, meal. I'm wondering how like the cut of the meat is for the prime rib. Meal. Guess you're gonna find out. It's very good. It's good. It's a little, it's a tiny bit chewy, but... Like gamey? Maybe try dipping in the anjou. Mm, that, looks, that looks good. Mm. Good? Oh. It's good chew. <laughs> I can't wait to try mine out. So this is actually honey pot drizzle. Not maple syrup. I love though that they have the honey theme throughout yeah. a lot of the options. Everything's got the honey for food. That chicken looks good. I'm gonna give a little honey drizzle right there, right on top. That looks really good. Mm. <laughs> that mac and cheese looks good too. That's good project. And that, it's not just straight honey. It has like a, a, a flavor. That's good fried chicken. I've had fried chicken in Disneyland at um, the Plaza. That's probably one of my favorite fried chickens ever. You also had at the Waldorf. Um, yeah, Waldorf is my favorite. Bull and Bear. Yeah. This isn't on those levels, but it's very close. Definitely not on Bull and Bear level, but it's close to Disneyland. I'd give the chicken an eight. What would you give your stuff? Um, I would give it um a seven i haven't tried the size yet maybe i'll bring it up yeah i don't think it's bad i just i don't think it's the best cut of meat that i've had okay. you, know, you can get good beef on disney property yeah I've had, some no. really, I've had some really great steaks before so on this trip too yeah uh so yeah we'll try everything out and then we'll come back to you with this. i think this looks like the highlight of this meal yeah when i was looking this stuff up online this is what i was looking forward to Yep. So this is the hummingbird cake. This is like a spice cake. Yep. And there's beignets. Beignets with chocolate sauce. This is a banana cream pie. Yes. And I forget what's in... Oh, do you have it pulled up? Uh, honey, honey of a cupcake. Okay, so it's a, a food themed cupcake. Um, and I believe there's a caramel center that our, uh, our waiter said. Looks really good. Alright, yeah, um, I guess you want to... Should we cut the cupcake in half first or should we just... Just go all out. Let's cut the cupcake in there. Okay. All right, so we're gonna see what's in the center of this. Breaking a lot easier than other cupcakes we've had this trip. Uh, right down the center. Oh. Aww. Can you see it? A little bit. You want to put it up more? I see. You see that caramel center? Looks oh, good. I am mean, looking off my hands. All right. Yeah. Let's eat it. All right. <laughs> so I thought the cupcake would be my favorite, but it was actually the banana cream pie. I think. Right? Yeah. I like the um. I mean, 
and cake a lot too. Yeah. It was different. I mean, they were cake old was good the desserts too. were really good. Yeah, I, I agree with that. That was a nice like assortment. I think that uh the value, I mean, given there's no characters right now, but I think the food is pretty good. No, I really like your prime rib. Food and I'm really full. And I'm pretty sure it's all you care to eat, so you can order seconds of uh your entrees and things like that, so. Yeah, it was like, what? It was 75 after the... After the pass holder discount, yeah, it was about 75 or 73 or 75 dollars for two people, for all was, you can that eat. That was a lot of food. At Disney? Yeah, not bad at all. That prime rib was good, my uh, fried chicken was good. The sides left a little something to be des desired. Yeah, I agree with that. But, um, I feel like it experience. started very strong with, like, yeah. the salad and the biscuits. I thought my entree was, like, it was I good. liked your prime rib. No, it was good, but it did like blow me away yeah but then it ended very strong with all those desserts yes completely the desserts were, were great and the cupcake was very moist had a great caramel center uh yeah so uh i would rate, rate the experience an 8 out of 10 definitely a place to try out at magic kingdom probably not my top disney dining experience. yeah i don't think i would go back yeah but i'm happy we did it yeah you know so uh yeah i think that'll do it for us here if you enjoyed the content Please like and subscribe. Hit the bell notification. So you know next time that our videos come out, we post a bunch of theme park content every Monday and Thursday. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much for liking. Don't count the days. Don't make the days count. See you next time. That's all, folks.